Hello, Pastor Steve Waldron. Glad you're here with us. Man, I have done reviews on Dake's books, Finest Dake's books, like God's Plan for Man, and his Bible, uh, probably three different reviews on that. Still gets a lot of views on the channel. And this is who he was. Now, I never knew Finest Dake. I have talked to his son, Finest Jr., back, man, that's been 35 years ago, probably. And... But I've known people who knew Finest Date. And uh, I, you know, I'm a oneness Pentecostal. He was Trinitarian Pentecostal. And like Brother Welch would debate him. They say he just had a totally photographic memory. There are several of you that watch regularly on this channel that you still say the Dake Study Bible is the very best Bible out there. Now, I may find it difficult to disagree just because of the list that he did. He would put everything, seven reasons for this, 13 reasons for this, this number of letters, you know, every book of the Bible, like every, is it how many letters are in each book and how many promises, how many prophecies, how many fulfilled prophecies. I mean, it is this tour de force. I wrote a little commentary on uh, Genesis recently and he was one of the sources that I used because just so much. Um, he had a, a little indiscretion at some point in his life. You can look that up on Wikipedia. A um, little controversy. And then probably the biggest thing he's been attacked from, from uh, even other Trinitarian Christians is his view of the Trinity. And it's where Benny Hinn got his famous statement, there's nine of them, that there's three personal body, soul, and spirit for each member of the Trinity. And even in the back of his Bible, he's got like three thrones in heaven instead of one throne for God, 24 thrones for the four and 20 elders. And so um, that's neat. And I, I haven't had a chance to read this. It even has controversy at Southwestern. Um, but I would like to date pastoring at Zion. Wonder if that's Zion out in Illinois with John Alexander Dowie, probably. What I have need of is God. But nobody can doubt his mind and his studiousness and printing them right here in Georgia. I'm from Georgia. I guess they're still printed right here in Georgia in a lot of great quality in Georgia and got in, you know, it used to be they were all black letter Bibles. Then they went to red letter. You know, they were black letter because he said that's all the words of Jesus. Jesus is the word. So I appreciated that. The only thing people didn't like about Dakes was the small print. They've reformatted it, better print, all that. So this is his life and ministry forward. Fascinatingly enough, by Marilyn Hickey. I love the guy's name, Leon Bible, who did this. And so Leon Bible, a graduate from Erskine Theological Seminary, is the senior pastor of Gospel Tabernacle in Lauren, South Carolina. I've done a lot of evangelistic work in Lauren, South Carolina. He is a noted Bible teacher, author, historical researcher, and authority on the Dake writings. He's author of a number of books, including Bible Basics for Spirit-Filled Believers and the four volumes of Tithe and Offering Scriptures. Um, he had a brief stint. This is going back to finest date. He had a brief stint as a hobo, a desire to be a cowboy actor and riding the range, a uh, two-week courtship and marriage lasting over 60 years. Yeah, effective Alexander Dowie's ministry on his life. Um, trials and confrontations faced for believing the word. Ability to quote from any chapter and verse in the Bible. See, that's just amazing. Nickname of the walking Bible and why. Touching, uh, excuse me, teaching from his Bible chart and so much more. So this is a few hundred pages. This is... Uh, Biblia. Yeah, it's over 400 pages with the bibliography. And so if you're into Pentecostal history, history, you like the Dake Bible, you may want to look at this. And this is a uh, an interesting book from an interesting individual and maybe because I'm here from Georgia sold so many date Bibles in my lifetime that maybe I've got more interest than a lot of people but again I don't know how many days it's sold in the millions 
think it's still set. Last I'd heard, this thing was 2.7 million, maybe more than that. And then his writings are awesome as well. But again, I'd have some disagreements with a lot of his teaching, but you know, overwhelmingly, just the minutia of scripture, you know, Bethlehem, you know, just different things, be in, in agreement with him. So God bless you. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, hit the bell notification, tell your friends and family. Love for everybody to join us every day. We just want to encourage people that the Bible is absolutely true and you can be saved. You can live for Jesus. He loves you. God bless you. We love you. Bye-bye.